In this video, we will discuss different approaches that you can take to completing your psychology journal. As you know, you must make five entries in your journal each week. These entries do not have to be a specified length, but should be more than a paragraph. The journal will count for 15% of your final grade, so you should strive to complete each entry and submit it on time each week so that you can obtain full credit. Each of the five days, you should reflect on something psychology related. This can be something covered by your reading that you wish to analyze, something that you've always wondered about, or just a thought that pops into your head. You may also use psychology-related magazines, newspaper articles, or other resources to spark some ideas. For example, let's open up Google and see what we find when we search psychology news. Now, of course you're not going to write about the psychology professor who killed his family, I hope, but you may find an article here that you become interested in. Take this one, for example. Though I deem it slightly inappropriate to discuss beer cans in your journal, the basis of the article is actually the psychology of what makes us want exclusive things. This could be an interesting topic to explore and write about. Just make sure if you're using something like this, you include a link to the article in your document. Use this journal as a way to relate to psychology and some of the things that you're interested in. It can be a fun way to explore new information.